Star Citizen is a fun, hot mess. For the past few months, I've been obsessed with this game. It's hands down the best video game experience I've had in, I don't know, over 15 years. Yeah, uh, I'm in the honeymoon period, uh, as some people call it. Uh, I'm, I'm still reacting to all the new experiences possible. Uh, and this is the first MMO I've played since maybe dipping into World of Warcraft 10 years ago. The game isn't finished. It, it's buggy as hell. Uh, people call it an alpha, and that can seem ridiculous. Is it okay for a game with 9 or 10 years of development to hide behind the word alpha? What I've learned is that the community isn't using that term to silence frustrated players. They're doing it to empathize with them and, and try to help new players have the appropriate expectations. This game will punch you in the stomach. You will get invested in it. You will try to make money in order to buy a new ship and then and then find out that uh, you know the game kind of takes, takes anything that you've earned and, and rips it apart and says, oops, sorry, that was an alpha. Don't get too attached to it. It's going to go away. This game breaks the meaning of alpha. This is a development game with a lot of scope creep. Because it was crowdfunded, it doesn't have to follow the traditional constraints of game funding and publishers. But that also means it gets to do things a traditionally funded game just wouldn't ever be able to tackle. I've had tons of fun playing with a handful of friends and even communities of other YouTubers. Here I am kind of working with Op4 for the Skunk Works for Commander Will and Kate's YouTube channel. And I've logged over 200 hours in the last few months. That's more than I've enjoyed most full-priced post-launch games. So this is kind of novel for me. People who've uh, spent any time on my YouTube channel know that I'm usually recording and putting up tutorials for things like Dungeons & Dragons or Foundry VTT. So this is a bit of a departure for me. Uh, I'll tell you the truth, I have burnt out on online D&D &D, uh, quite a bit. Uh, I played it as an obsession uh, during the first part of the pandemic here and well we're, we're mid delta now so uh, hopefully that ends soon but Star Citizen has been keeping me company this last couple of months playing with my friends and kind of exploring everything that's in here and I've also had a new computer with a new graphics card that has a recording capability so that's what you're seeing here you're seeing a couple months of me having a heck of a lot of fun with this game so sit back uh, and uh, here's some of the best moments, uh, you know, just kind of great memories of messing around with this janky, hot mess of a game that if you like Space Sims, maybe if you were like me and you, you grew up with uh, TIE Fighter or Wing Commander or any of those other things, sometimes just drooling over them on my friend's, lap, friend's parents' laptops uh, before I ever had enough money to have my own computer. Uh, enjoy, and uh, maybe I'll see you out there in the verse, as they say. All right, well, I'll turn the audio back on for my recordings and you'll hear me and my friends uh, fooling around some spaceships. Oh, who are these people also trying this exploit here? <laughs> weird. weird. Hey guys, oh, fine so day weird. to be carrying a box, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Wait! Did you bring James, your box? You I brought my box. <laughs> James, how are you carrying that box with one hand? Yeah, Tell I know, me. right? I'm just, you gotta hit the gym a little bit more. <laughs> Alright, so I can oh, The frames! My frames! Medium. Okay. I've got heavy armor. Arms. Right. I'm going to be there, but I could right. not grab it. I was not close enough. Joe right. just Leroy Jenkins. Alright. There's an airlock. Alright, Joey, move up a little bit so that I can. Yeah. And look down as far as I can. I can't see my flare to activate it. So. My flare is out. Closing active. airlock door. Okay. Moving. Forward. Probably two up on that circular yeah, pedestal. There's three at One. least. Up, there's three at least high. Oh. oh, I see movement on the balcony. Coming down the stairs. Back into the room. Yeah, and, 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 it's and, one. It's one high right. 
One high left. One high right. Got him. High left is clear. High right. I okay. am low on you, Joe. Alright. Oh, did he run? Where'd he nice. run to? That is a big row. Oh, fuck this guy. Oh, I shot him head. Contact. I'm reloading at the wrong time. Okay, I see the warp core. Reload. A lot Still of reloading. Uh, I need to. I need to mend Take your place. Take your place. He's down. There might be another one off to the right, though. Uh, armor, Did you go into engineering? My armor yes, took most there of that. Another one off good. to the right. Yep, that one's down. There's another one. That one's down. All over Using it. Elevator. Oh, I see it. Oh, what? Wow. <laughs> all right, all right, get on. Move. Getting got. Use elevator. Oh, it's a yeah. All right, moving to dead stick. Do you want to park your Nox in one of the uh, the the cargo bays? Let's try. This thing has a cargo bay. No, it's got missile bays. <laughs> sure, open the missile bays. Missile bays open. Open the bomb bay doors, hell. Yeah, uh, you want to try the forward bomb bay. You kind of need to fit yourself between two torpedoes. Man, it gets. Oh, you're gonna totally fit in there, man. Alright. All right. Close the doors. Closing? Power it off. I need to come see you. <laughs> I need to see this. <laughs> alright, alright. Uh, I don't know how to turn this thing. Oh, I can, I, no, I can see you. I can totally see you from here. All right, yeah. <laughs> torpedoes. Yep, and you're now at a, at a door that can... All right. Yes. Yes. <laughs> you can store your knocks in there. <laughs> so what you're saying is we can do that move with Black Widow from, from the movie where she drops out of this thing with the butt in, the, in a motorcycle? Yeah. Uh, landing gear, please. What? <laughs> No, wait, those are the bomb doors. <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, you're not clipping on anything. Nope, something just fell down. I the knocks fell. I you dropped the, the knocks. I, open opened the, the... I, I opened the bomb doors, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, you he's... totally did drop your knocks. <laughs> knocks bombs. Yes. <laughs> I'm, I'm just flying entirely in third person mode, so I don't know. Yeah, your gears are down. You're good. Good clearance. Seven. Six. Five. Should we need to fire? These are the size 9 torps? Yes. There's multiple types of size 9 torps. Ned Cooper Field on the edge of the asteroid field. Thank you, sir. I, I'm going to turn missile base to target 4, 7, and firing. Firing. There we go. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. You get a good good angle on it. I did it with the third person camera view. Uh, using, the hit. using the director mode, yeah. God, it's good. A little high. Yeah. 
trying to position my third person camera to play nice. There we go. And it. Hopefully I shot him enough, because I don't see lasers coming from, There it um, goes. Here we go. 56k. Yeah. Same. Contract complete. Oh, it's beautiful. I think that was 56k just for destroying the yeah. Idris. I think I got a last shot of 5,000 on him. Nice. Nice. Beautiful. That was a beautiful explosion. Loved it. All right, right the Anvil Hawk, here? Owen Mendelson. Yeah, thanks, you, I guess, you, Owen. Owen, why don't you get out of here? More like Owen Mendelson. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Another Idris stolen by Arlington Gang. Do we want it? <laughs> they love stealing those Idrises. You could try a different uh, build. For yeah, we try a different build. I take the mission so no one else grabs it. Yep. Uh... Yeah, I'm into, I'm into doing it. another one. And three, two, one. James yep. kind of shot ahead of the rest of us. But yeah, yeah. That ahead. I saw Joey shoot ahead. Joey. Sorry, nobody's yeah. I'm just not gonna move when we get there. Yeah, I don't see Pips for behind me. Oh, okay. Pip, somebody's right off my wing. No. I think. Do we exit all oh, in shit. the same? Oh, oh hi guys! <laughs> cool. cool, cool, cool. Oh man, oh, man. We... we 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 exited in formation. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, when we very pull close into to all later, that is going to look really weird. Yeah, the only thing you can do is get up on here and piss them off. Hi guys, yeah. glitching through your bar. I'm gonna roll over it. You oh, no. Ow. I'm pretty sure that's Chris Roberts. He's like, oh, you don't want this? Okay, fine. Let me just shunt this to nothing. Dump it out into space. Jumping. Jumped without us. Right. Jumped without us. And my QT failed. I have to re- Yep, now I'm recalibrating. Uh, wait, I, I think just died. Alistar... I just died. Alistar jumped away from me. I am Wait, dead. How did you? No, I'm out in space. Where the fuck is my ship? What just happened? I think I jumped ahead of my ship. Hey, Sam, come along for the ride. Hopefully, I just woke oh. up in a hab. The QT failed. Okay. What what hab are you at? I don't know, but I was recording that. I think I'm nope. now one point. I'm I'm, I'm back at Crew All One. Is my, my ship Q there? Can you go to Port Alasar and see if my ship is there? My QT is consistently failing, Dalasar. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to jump that... to Arkel 3 first. You could do like a mini hop. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to do a mini hop to uh, Arkel 3. But, but at Port Alasar specifically, is there a, well, maybe we'll a ship let you know full in of scrap just a there? second. No? Okay. It might just be a pile of scrap. Standing How did by? you die? Do you have any idea? We're going to... I think you're going to see the recording of it. 